Hannah from Cooking with Plants and today I'm making a special Thanksgiving recipe for all of my American friends. It is sweet and sour tomato onion relish and this is perfect to serve with any nut loaves that you may have, with tofu dishes, anywhere where you want that slightly sweet and sour taste. Absolutely amazing and you can print the recipe off my website as always at cookingwithplants.com. So first up I'm adding some tomatoes. I'm using cherry tomatoes but you can use any tomatoes or tomatoes that you like and you could even use some tinned tomatoes and that will add to the sauce in this dish. So I'm using cherry tomatoes today about 250 grams worth. You can cut these in half as well. Totally up to you how you use them. I've also sliced up one large onion. I've cut it lengthways just because I like that texture. But again, you could cut this into fine cubes. Totally up to you. I'm also adding in one clove of garlic that's been minced up. As well as some mustard seeds and some curry powder. And then just give this a bit of a stir through. Next I'm going to add in some brown sugar. You could also use coconut sugar or if you want to avoid sugar altogether just add some dried raisins that will work perfectly too. And a teaspoon of coarse Celtic sea salt. And again, just combine all those ingredients, mix it all through really well. And if you wanted to, you can also cook this in a pot. It doesn't have to be a flat fry pan. And just stir this through for a minute or so, just to infuse those flavors and to caramelize the onion and sugar. And then finally, add some apple cider vinegar to this. And then turn down the heat and let this simmer for about half an hour or so until it's nicely broken down. Okay, so this has been cooking for about 40 minutes and it's nice and broken down and smells delicious. So I'm going to turn the heat off now and give it a taste test. So tasty sweet from the onions and that curry flavor coming through. Mm, a really delicious combination. I really hope that you give it a try for your Thanksgiving dinner or lunch. And don't forget to share your photos and tag me on Instagram or Facebook. I'd love to see what you do with this recipe. Mm, yum, I'm gonna go make sandwiches and put some of this on there actually. So happy Thanksgiving and I look forward to seeing you for the next recipe. Bye for now. Mm-mm.